Evet arkadaşlar biz bu ekibin 23 Katar ekibin 22 ben Arjantin ile Fransa'yı finalde oynattım. Arjantin Messi'nin penaltısı ile 1-0 kazandı. İyi seyirler umarım beğenirsiniz. FIFA 2023 ile yorumlarınızı bekliyorum. Haydi görüşürüz hoşçakalın. Versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. And since they have the ball, a referee playing advantage here. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris between the posts. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Ousmane Dembele out wide. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Opportunity! And throwing himself up the ball. Whipped in by Griezmann. Many. The supporters want to see him have a go. A concession of a corner here. <laughs> Disappointing delivery, sailing over everyone in the middle. Now well, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Rodrigo de Paul He's showing a real will to win the ball He's very alert defending to put a stop to the chance Possession changing hands. Giroud. Here's Mbappe. And he's in. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top class save. Just look how he reacts. And over it comes. And he clears the danger. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. He's showing good defensive judgment. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. Well, they need to be more positive with their passing. Make more runs in behind the defence. Create overloads in the wide areas. And then we may see an improvement in those stats. And struggling even to just get hold of the ball here. Well, it could be on for him here. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, they've got things going again here. And I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Opportunity in the wide area. A chance to whip it in. And clears the danger. Oh, great vision. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. And he might be through here. 
And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. Playing it in. Giroud. He's lost it. Mbappe. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, not the best effort we've ever seen, Stuart. Well, I think it's fair to say he won't be taking the next one. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Rabiot still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it and it should have been the first goal of the game well I can't believe that chance has been squandered that should have been the opener Mbappe zero oh did so well to deny him No one latched onto it. And reading it absolutely superbly. Can they hit on the break? They need to get bodies back. Magnificent defending. Oh, what's he gone and done? And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. And that was a very fine read. Really looking comfortable with the ball at his feet as he runs Olivier Giroud. Not to be in terms of the finish. He saw the situation developing. Just ten minutes to go. On the attack, is there to be late drama? But into the keeper's gloves. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is, and a chance for them to forge ahead. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. And slots it home! Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no whatsoever. That's a strange decision. dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider they've got to be really mindful of the time situation attacking though they might be bodies forward and the break looks on well it petered out Giroud now Griezmann happy to take on the shot well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. Played in by Griezmann. Now the attack fizzled out. And there goes the final whistle. For the third time in history, Argentina have won the World Cup. And I have to say, Derek, they've been the best team in the tournament. There's no doubt about that.